Hello, today just gonna be a short video. Do you remember the 20 mil that I had on my hardcore Iron Man? I got it by woodcutting magic trees. I think I chopped like 12,000 or something. Then I fletched all of them, made them into longbows. I alt everything, add in a few rune drops that I got from Slayer and there, there it was, I had 20 mil in, in the bank. The problem was that I wasn't really saving for anything. It was just 20 mil sitting in the bank for whatever reason. So I thought maybe it's about time we spend that money, but where? I was thinking about a few skills, maybe smithing, but there's really no reason. Sure, I progress, I level up my total level, but there is currently no reason to level up smithing. Same with construction, I wouldn't have enough money to really have like the best pools or anything, plus you need hard blood. And then it came to my brain that I have to level up my magic level. Because think about it, the whole time I was preparing for Zelda, like for the past two weeks or so, the only reason why I didn't kill Zelda is because of constant disconnects. But I have full void, I have mage's book, I have infinity boots, I have the weak trident. It's pretty much the perfect year to go to Zelda. The only problem was that I think my max hit was 21 or 22. That was because my magic level was pretty low. It was only 86. And the higher it is, the more you are hitting with trident. So it just makes sense. That's, that's exactly what I did. I spent the whole 20 mil on 100k chaos runes. And I think it was 47k death runes or something like that. I ran out of money. I wanted to go for 25k casts. I went for like 23.5k or so. One more cast and that is 94 magic. I was 86 when I started. This is crazy. But you know what's even crazier? That I got from 86 to 94 magic in one day. That's right. I have not slept yet. This is 20 hours later since the last commentary. You wanna see some XP gains? 200k experience an hour and I managed to pull this off for 20 hours. I think it's like 21 hours or something. Total experience gained in magic 4.1 million in one session. Just like that. I'm actually very tired. I don't usually, I know some people go for like 24 hours. That's not me. And not only magic experience, but also 2.1 million HP experience was gained. 100k experience an hour. I'm not sure what HP level I was at the time. I completely forgot that um, it was, I, I focused on magic levels mostly. I, I forgot that I may level up HP levels as well. So this is crazy. Like, for me, 20 mil is not that much, even on an Iron Man. And if I can get 4 million experience in one day, this just sounds crazy. And this was completely AFK. Like, am I doing something now? No. No, I'm just AFKing. It's actually quite a bad spawn. You sh you're supposed to be, like, spreading these monkeys a little bit like this. Uh, go, like, in the middle or something. And you just leave. Just drink the prey pods. And some of you may say, why are you killing these monkeys? Why not go for something like neck reels that can drop lots of gold and you can just get a, at least half of your money back? Or something like uh, dust devils. They drop a lot of runes. You could get a lot of chaos runes. Well, prayer potions are, is something that I don't have. I don't have that many of them. I do have like 300, which is a lot, but most of them are for Zelda. After I finish using them, I have no more seeds. So if you go to this place, as you can see, these drop unlimited supply of prey pots. You don't need to bring your own prey pots. Like I brought, I think two of them. I drank because I was too lazy to pick uh, these up, but you don't need any prey pots. That's why I chose this place. Also, this one is s extremely AFKable. Like look, one cast 357 experience, 400 experience, come on. 353. Now this is combined with HP, so you don't just get it on on magic, but you can see I'm not doing anything. I'm, I'm literally, I was playing some other game for like 10 hours or something, and I was just completely AFKing in here. So yeah, hopefully I will be able to go back to regular hardcore item and progress videos, and servers will not start lagging again, because this is the third day now, no lags, no disconnects, except for that one weird thing that just happened, but... We should be good. Finally, I may start killing some things. Thank you for watching, though. I'll see you very soon.